Hi, I'm Richard Carlton. Welcome to the Coach's Corner. Hey, everyone. My name is Miles Debsky, one of the coaches here at RCC. And today I have a pretty cool tip for you guys. I'm actually going to demo a technique that came up in one of my coaching sessions recently. And it's about some advanced but actually pretty simple finds that you can do for getting specific date ranges out of your database. So here I am in a copy of FM Starting Point. Um, and here we have our follow-up dates, right? Last follow-up, next follow-up. So I just dragged out on the field here this next follow-up date, and we're going to use that just for our little demo uh, to show off this find technique here. And what my customer wanted to do was to find an easier way to find multiple records in different quarters, you know, like January, February, March. That would be quarter one, quarter two, four through six, etc., across multiple years. So they wanted to search on this date. So we know that if I just wanted to find all of my January through March, I could do, you know, January 2019 and do a range with the dot, dot, dot through March 2019. And I find these six dates here. But what they're wanting is, okay, let me find, you know, let's say four, five, six, anything from those three months and across multiple years, so 2019 and 2020. And so this is a pretty cool technique. It's the fastest and the easiest way to solve this problem. Instead of creating a quarter field and trying to track it that way, we can go into a manual find and on this field, insert this squiggly bracket here. We'll do our four dot 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 six, close squiggly bracket then our date bracket, and we could actually do a range for the day also, but let's just do any day, so we'll give it an asterisk, then another normal bracket, and then we want two different years, so let's do 2019, and then range to 2020, close that, let's hit our perform find and see what we get. 138 records, and as I start just clicking through these, you'll see we have anything from April, May and June of not just 2019, but if I go to the end here, look at the, these are all June 2020. So we searched across a range of months and years, and we could even take one step further if we want to, and also do a range for that day. Pretty cool function finding on date fields. And yeah, that's it for this week's Coach's Corner Tip. If you have any questions or interest in our coaching program, please send an email to support at RC Consulting. And if you'd love to learn more about fines and about date fields, check out our video courses over at fmtraining.tv. And also make sure you download a copy of our fully unlocked solution, FM Starting Point, at fmstartingpoint.com. Thank you all and have a great week.